Okay, so she's already laughing because if musicians in bars <laughs> getting beers, Jessica Mundo. And she just did some time on CIUT right now from Steve's Music. So say hi. Hello. And what did you do today on CIUT? I played a few songs, and then they interviewed me about my up-and-coming uh, vinyl record that I'm going to be releasing. I'm going to be releasing the A side this summer, and then the B side I will be releasing a few months down the road. And then we're going to bring it all together with uh, onto vinyl with some cool artwork and stuff. So uh, I've been really focusing on hitting the studio pretty hard, and um, I'm I'm really excited. I've been kind of laying low with uh, gigs lately because I've just been focusing on getting this done and getting it right. So you might not be back at Beaches Jazz this year. I'm not quite sure. Uh, for now, not. But somehow, I always end up getting there. So. We'll see. Okay, that's cool. Anything else uh, on the agenda for Jessica? Just, like I said, focusing on finishing this this uh, vinyl, uh, this A-side to this vinyl, and uh, pretty much that. And who invited you to this CIUT? Was that Nick B? No, actually, that was Brad K. Who okay. And how do you guys know each other? Uh, I met him through a friend who's also going to be playing, Nina Hardy. Uh, uh, I met him, him through her, and he works here at Steve's too. He does some stuff at, here and there, but he's also a producer and uh, engineer. And he, we've been ever since I met him, he became a very good friend of mine, and uh, we've been working together on this album. I'm so excited. That's very cool. Who else is on it? Uh, well, Marlon Van Ziel is uh, playing uh, percussion. Is uh, he's in part of my uh, band. And uh, Chris Chazon, who's playing bass. Um, and I'm not quite sure. There's going to be a couple of guitar players throughout, uh, lead guitar players throughout uh, the album. So we're not quite sure who's going to do what yet. But we're that's, uh, that's actually our next on the agenda is well, getting in the lead guitars. Maybe Ed Bernard? I'm not sure. We'll see. There's a oh. few of them. I'm not sure. He did play some, vi uh, some uh, violin on one, so we'll see. Ah, very cool. Ah, that was the picture I just saw on Facebook. That was your studio time that he had. He, I saw Ed with the violin. Somebody posted it. Oh, did he? Yeah. Did. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Yeah. So, okay, so any uh, particular release date in mind? Not, uh, I don't have an exact because we're not, we're still trying to get through it. We're getting close, so it's going to be this summer. Oh, awesome. It is going to be this summer, but. Oh, that's cool. Uh, we don't have an exact date yet, so we got to finish this and we got to finish it right before I release sure. it. So. Yep. And that's going to be an indie release? Yes. Self release, self yep. produced? Yep. That's great. Self release, self uh, self produced. I'm excited. That's so great. 